Welcome friends. In this very important video, I am going to tell you my next target of Bitcoin, Litecoin, Ethereum and some other coins. So please sit relax and please subscribe my YouTube channel, join my Telegram channel. Links are in this video description and uh, please friends show your support and please like, like this video for more informative content and very useful information. Here you can see this is the Bitcoin Tether US 1 hour Binance chart uh, and you can see in my yesterday's video I was told you that uh, Bitcoin uh, was in this symmetrical triangle and here you can see the breakout and price goes to here you can see and hit the level of 30,900 approximately. It was if you take this trade, then it will let me please show you. It was approximately 4% trade. Uh, congratulations to all of you who took this trade. Uh, no, uh, main question is that what is the next target for the Bitcoin right now? And uh, maybe Bitcoin uh, is going to hit uh, next all time high. Uh, these all things I am uh, going to tell you in this video so please focus on this video and please uh, sh uh, please show your support to me and uh, let me please arrange this again uh, we have to move, uh, uh, remove I have to remove some drawings for this uh, these are these are unnecessary right now and if you are a new user then please uh, subscribe my YouTube channel and if you want to trade on Binance or Bybit exchange, then you can go to in this video's comment section or in this video's description where you can find the link of the Bybit exchange where you can get $600 bonus absolutely free. And these are the this is the list of bonus. And if you want to join Binance exchange, then uh, click on this link which is in this video's description and in this video comment section and open your account within 10 seconds let's focus to the uh, on the content and here you can see bitcoin uh, bitcoin was struggling in between these uh, support and resistance and here you can see bitcoin break this resistance towards upside uh, this is some uh, i think uh, similar like a w pattern i think so and uh, if we calculate the target uh, let me please calculate the target uh, we have to put it from here then we have to put it at the here you can see let me please label on this and uh, I am definitely going to tell you my next uh, uh, upside target to all of you here you can see $37,900 is the main target right now but for this Bitcoin must have to close this overly candle above this uh, resistance which is at $34,000 level and after that Bitcoin must have to uh, break this resistance which is at $35,500 to $35,600 level then definitely it will going to hit $37,900 maybe $38,000 level. This is the one scenario and maybe uh, this is the most likely scenario right now and if Bitcoin break this towards downside and after that maybe we see some sideways action like this and maybe Bitcoin again going to hit uh, 31,000 after that maybe we see a pullback. This is the second scenario. You have to wait, you have to watch this level very very carefully which is $34,000 level. If any candle close below $34,000 level this will be the indication that maybe we may see a dip in Bitcoin price and Bitcoin price may be down to $31,000 and currently it is the most likely scenario and it is telling us that Bitcoin definitely is going to hit $37,900 level but for this Bitcoin must have to break this resistance level which is at $35,600 to $35,800 level. If Bitcoin break this resistance and then definitely Bitcoin will hit $37,900 and but this resistance is very very important right now for the Bitcoin. Let me please remove this some drawings. Let me please show you the volume. Volume is very very important and here you can see we see some uh, uh, 
I think, a decent volume right now in that candle. In that candle, here you can see. And uh, let me please remove this. Let me please show you the EMA ribbon. Here you can see. Bitcoin candles are above EMA ribbon. EMA ribbon is currently at $31,100 level and no turning as a spot for the Bitcoin right now. Uh, let me show you the 4 hour EMA ribbon. Here you can see. Here you can see. Here you can see. A candle is currently uh, currently this candle is above uh, this four hour EMA ribbon. This is very very good sign for the Bitcoin. But this candle, uh, but uh, two two hours and fifty minutes are remaining. Two hours and fifty one minutes are remaining to close this candle. If uh, Bitcoin close this overly candle above thirty five thirty four thousand dollars level, then definitely definitely it is going to hit. Maybe thirty five hundred six uh, thirty five thousand six hundred and maybe thirty seven thousand. These are the targets right now for me. Please note these targets and uh, please do not use high leverage in your trades. Let me please show you my next chart, which is the most important chart right now. This is the Ethereum chart. In my previous video, I was told you Ethereum was in this bull flag and here you can see how oh, beautifully Ethereum hit my target. Congratulations to all of you who took this trade. And now what is next for me? Let me please tell you the, let me please remove this. Let me please tell you the target. And here you can see Bitcoin, uh, sorry, Ethereum uh, break this uh, uh, resistance uh, and close overly candles above this uh, this resistance let me please show you the EMA ribbon EMA ribbon is currently at $1400 level and candles are very above and uh, very high from that level now let me please tell you my next target of Ethereum let me please zoom this let me please show you my for our chart of Ethereum. Here you can see EMA ribbon of 4 hour is at 1330 and very below to these uh, candles. And let me please arrange this chart and let me please show you one hour again. One hour chart. Let me please hide this. Now the official target, I think, so as according to my TA for the Ethereum will be, I think so. This will be the next target for the Ethereum for me. 1588 dollars level and uh, if Ethereum move towards upside and hit this level maybe after that we see some rejection and but now uh, ethereum is very strong and uh, if in any case ethereum close over the candle below this uh, resistance level which is uh, 1400 dollars level then this will be the sign that maybe ethereum go to 360 uh, or 370 and if ethereum break this towards downside this rising channel break if ethereum break this rising channel towards downside from that point or from that point then the target bearish target for the ethereum will be 1242 currently these are two targets uh, to me this is the most likely 1588 and this is the less likely let me please show you my next chart which is xrp here you can see XRP is in this ascending triangle. Any breakout of ascending triangle will lead uh, XRP ripple to. Here you can see very very beautiful target. Here 
if break towards downside then let me please show you the target Zero point thirty and zero point twenty five. This is the bullish target for me. This is the uh, bearish target for me. Ripple must have to break this towards upside, and after that maybe we see some uh, retesting, and after that maybe Ripple is going to hit this level. But if unfortunately uh, this is the most unlikely, if Ripple break this towards downside, then definitely it will hit this level. Which is zero point twenty five five. These are the two levels for me. The next chart is EOS EOS USDT. Here you can see this is the this is the four hour chart uh, one hour chart. Here you can see EOS break this uh, rising channel towards downside and uh, let me please remove this. Let me show you the bearish target for XRP EOS will be, I think so. If uh, this happens, then definitely it is going to hit 2.57. But I this is the uh, most unlikely. I think EOS will go up and will hit this target. I think so, which is 2.9. Currently, my most likely target for the EOS will be two point nine dollars level. Please trade carefully and do not use high leverage. And please, friends, show your support. Please like this video and please subscribe my Telegram, uh, join my Telegram channel, because I regularly updated on my Telegram channel. You can find the link of the Telegram in, in this video description. And if you want to open Bybit account, then you will get six hundred dollar bonus absolutely free. Just go to into in this video description where you can find the link of this Bybit exchange and where you can get these kind of these all bonuses absolutely free. And if you want to open a Binance account, then uh, go to in this video description or in this video comment section where you can find Binance link. Just click on this link and open uh, open your new account within thirty seconds. Let me please show you, friends, my next chart, which is Litecoin. Litecoin is in this rising channel right now and break this uh, resistance level. This is not a support level. This is a resistance level. Uh, let me please change the color. And uh, I think uh, Litecoin must have to hit this level. And uh, let me please. Uh, uh, tell you my next target for the Litecoin. The next target for the Litecoin, I think this is the most likely to me and to all of you too, is this. 154 is the next target if Litecoin moves towards upside and hit this after may, uh, that maybe we see some rejection. And if Litecoin uh, break towards downside, then this will be the support level for the right, uh, Litecoin right now. One hundred and forty dollars level. If light can move towards downside and break this one hundred and forty dollars level, then it will uh, down to one hundred and thirty-five dollars level. Let me please show you my next chart, which is Wi-Fi USDT. Currently, Wi-Fi is struggling in this uh, zone. Let me please show you. This is, this is the support zone, this is the resistance zone, and this is the support zone. And if we calculate the target of this, uh, let me please clear this. Then our next target will be, my next target for the Wi-Fi is 34,933. If break towards downside, then let me please tell you my next tar bearish target of the Wi-Fi. 
this is the next biggest target for the wi fi now right now for me 28972 uh, but for this uh, wi fi must have to break this support zone which is at 31000 dollars level if wi fi if wi fi break this uh, support zone and close over the candle below this uh, downtrend line then definitely it will uh, going to hit 28900 or uh, I think this is the most likely $35,900 level. Let me please show you the link wine chart. This is the link wine. Link wine is in this ascending triangle and maybe we see a breakout of this ascending tri triangle at 27th of January or maybe 26th of January or maybe today because candles are getting close, close getting closer and closer to this uh, downtrend line. If in any case, if in any case, uh, chain link break this ascending triangle, triangle towards downside, then definitely it will going to hit 20, 20.82 dollars level. But for this, remember friends, please remember, but for this breakout or breakdown, we need a high volume like this. We need a high volume like this. We need a like, uh, we need a high volume like this. We need a high volume like this. If this breakout or breakdown will, with strong candle and with uh, uh, good candle, then definitely this breakout and breakdown will definitely get the, the targets let me please show you my upside target let me please here you can see this is the upside target for the link coin right now for me uh, let me please show you 29.58 maybe we see some sideways action like this like this like this like this like this and after that we see a pullback we see this breakout let me please friend show you my next chart friend i am doing this videos only for you uh, i am making this videos only for you please please show your support to me and please subscribe my youtube channel and join my telegram channel too and please please like this video here you can see this is the stellar lumens uh, us dollar one hour chart of Binance, and here you can see stellar is struggling in this uh, horizontal channel and let me please show you the next uh, target for the stellar coin uh, for me if stellar coin break this towards upside then our next upside target of Steeler will be 0 0.30 and if this breakout happens towards downside then our target will be 0 0.24 but for this uh, Steeler must have to be, break this uh, resistance uh, support zone uh, which is currently at 0 0.27 if any overly candle close below this level which is 0 0.2640 then definitely Steeler will hit this target and uh, if any uh, overly candle close above 0 0.29 dollars level then definitely it will go to 0 0.3008 these are the targets right now for me in stellar coin let me please show you my next chart which is the wet usdt vchain vchain uh, vchain was struggling in this uh, uh, horizontal channel right now and if we can close our overly candle above this uh, level then definitely we can is going to hit 
इफ बीच एंड क्लोज ओवरली कैंडल अब जीरो पॉइंट थर्टी टू फाइव एंड देन डेफिनेटली इट इज गोइंग टू हिट माई नेक्स्ट टारगेट विच इज एट जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री फाइव फाइव टू एंड इफ रिजेक्टेड देन डेफिनेटली इट विल डाउन टू जीरो पॉइंट जीरो टू नाइन दिस ओवर द कैंडल इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इफ दिस ओवर द कैंडल क्लोज अब दिस स्पोर्ट जोन विच इज एट जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री टू फोर देन डेफिनेटली इट विल गो टू दिस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री फाइव थ्री डबल फाइव Let me please show you my next chart, which is Ada USD. Here you can see Ada is in this uh, horizontal, or some, you can say some. Uh, it is uh, it is horizontal channel, I think. And uh, if uh, Ada Cardano break this towards upside, then our target will be this level, this. Uh, horizontal resistance which is at 0.397 0.397 dollars level and if rejected then definitely we may see some sideways like this and like this and after that it will definitely going to hit 0.338 these are two levels for me right now in cardano coin but for this breakout or breakdown we must have high volume candles Uh, candle and uh, currently volume is very low here you can see these are the upside and downside targets for me and we may see maybe we may see some sideways action like this let me please show you my next chart which is tron let me please remove some drawings friends please show your support to me and please please like this video if you don't like uh, please friends show your support and like this video tron is in this rising broadening uh, wedge and if tron break this uh, rising broadening wedge towards downside then definitely it will going to hit let me please show you because this is a bearish pattern pattern that is why i am uh, asking this 0.028 let me please show you the next resistance level for the tron this is the next resistance level for the tron 0.03324 uh, if tron close over the candle above this zone or this resistance then definitely tron uh, will go high otherwise maybe we see some sideways action in tron and if tron break this uh, horizontal support and break this uh, down trend line which is currently at uh, 0.030 then definitely it is going it will hit maybe 0.028 let me please show you my next chart which is the polka dot Polkadot is struggling in this uh, horizontal channel, and uh, you can see. And uh, right now is in this rising channel. If broke uh, break towards upside, then definitely it will go to. Let me please show you. If break this towards this from that level, then definitely it will go to this level. otherwise maybe it will go to this level and after that we may see a dip and if break towards downside then let me please tell you the target then our target will be 
16.06 dollar uh, this uh, down uh, uh, down trend line uh, which is 11.80 dollars level is very very important for the uh, polka dot right now if break this down trend line and close over the candle below this uh, down trend line then definitely it is going to hit this level 16.06 uh, maybe it will go down and hit 19.6 and if broke this then definitely it is going to hit 20 dollars and maybe 22 dollars level uh, currently we have to focus on these uh, downtrend line which is 17.80 uh, or, or you can say 18 dollars level and you have to focus on this up, upside uh, uh, horizontal uh, resistance which, which is at 19.50 uh, dollars level these two trend lines are very important for the polka dot right now let me please show you my next chart bnb here you can see bnb is struggling in this horizontal channel and now it is in this rising channel or you can say ascending channel and if bnb break this towards downside then our target will be at this level which is at 39.5 and if broke this uh, resistance zone which is at 43.46 and close over the candle above this then definitely it is going to hit 44 dollars and if broke this 44 dollar uh, and broke this uh, towards upside uh, this ascending channel towards upside then definitely it is going to hit $47 level all eyes are on this horizontal resistance which is currently at 43.45 you can say 43.50 and if any hourly candle close above this 43.60 or 43.50 then it will first uh, the first target is 44 and if break this upper trend line uh, which is at $44 level then definitely it will it, it will go to $47 level if this rejected from if BNB rejected from that point then maybe we see a dip and maybe it will again retest this 42.2 and if break this toward downside then definitely 39.52 is the level uh, target uh, we have to focus uh, on this uh, upper trend line which is currently at 43.50 and this down trend line which is at 42.3 if any overly candle close above this horizontal resistance then definitely it will going to hit 47 dollars if any overly candle uh, close below this horizontal uh, down trend line uh, sorry uh, down trend line it is not horizontal uh, if uh, if bnb close uh, over the candle below this down trend line uh, which is uh, 42 dollar 42.1 i think so then definitely it will hit 39.5 please note these levels Let me please show you my next chart, which is one inch USDT. One of my uh, subscriber was asking me to uh, please show you, please show uh, one inch uh, chart. Here you can see this is the one inch chart. Uh, one inch, uh, one inch is currently is in this uh, ascending triangle. If overly candle break uh, this ascending triangle towards downside at any point, uh, then definitely it will lead to. Uh, so the first target will be 2.1 and uh, I think we we may see some sideways action maybe like this and after that we may see some upside action and it will hit to 2.94 these are two targets right uh, right uh, now for me uh, 2.97 uh, which is the upside target and 2.1 which is the downside target we have to focus if overly candle close, uh, if even inch of close overly candle below this downtrend line, which is 2.45 dollars level, 
then definitely it will go down to 2.11 or maybe it will go down to 1.72 otherwise it will uh, move sideways or it will go down to hit 2.97 or maybe three dollars level let me please show you my next chart Friends, I want your support very, very much. Please, please like this video and please join my Telegram channel and please subscribe my YouTube channel. This is the new chart I am adding in my videos right now. This is the Bitcoin Cash because many of my friends are asking me to add this chart. Here you can see. Uh, Bitcoin Cash was in this uh, horizontal uh, channel and break this horizontal channel towards the upside. Next target for the uh, Bitcoin Cash will be, let me please show you, here you can see, I am much certain that it definitely it will going to hit $507 level or $500 level in very much near future. This is the target for the Bitcoin Cash right now. Next chart is Uniswap. Here you can see <clears throat> Uniswap is currently in this uh, rising uh, broadening uh, wedge, and here you can see it break towards downside. Then our next target, of bearish target of this uh, Unicoin, will be at this level, which is 9.02. And if uh, Uniswap hold this support uh, zone then definitely it will go up and maybe it will hit 13.47 or 13.50 dollars level and we have to focus the, on this uh, downtrend line which is 11.30 dollars level if any over the candle close below 11.25 dollars then it will hit 9.07 dollars level very soon let me please show you my next chart which is the KMC USDT Kusama coin here you can see Kusama is in this horizontal channel and uh, any breakout towards upside and downside let me please tell you the targets if uh, kusama break towards upside then our target will be one hundred and twenty seven and if kusama break towards downside then our target will be I think so this is this zone 86.2 uh, please uh, note this these levels uh, upside level is uh, upside uh, horizontal uh, horizontal resistance is at 113.50 if uh, Kusama close over the candle above this level which is at uh, 140 14 dollars level then it will going to hit 127 but the only condition will be the volume if if this breakout or break uh, down happens with this high volume with high volume then definitely it was going to hit 127 maybe 16 dollars level if breakout towards upside then 127 if break down towards uh, downside then it is 6 dollars level uh, we have to watch these uh, horizontal support and uh, 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 down support uh, down support is currently at uh, $100 level if any over the candle below uh, 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 KSM close below $100 level then definitely uh, it will hit 86.85 uh, but the only condition is the uh, high volume if close over the candle below $100 with high volume then definitely it is going to hit $86 if any over the candle close above 40, 114 dollars level then kusama definitely uh, is going to hit 127 otherwise we may we may see this the sideways action like this let me please show you my next chart which is the algo algorand here you can see friend Algorand is in this uh, rising wedge 
and if any breakout of this rising wedge, let me please calculate the target. If Algorand uh, break this towards downside and close hourly candle below $0.59 level, then definitely uh, uh, if this happens with uh, high volume, then definitely it is going to hit this level which is at 0 0.52 otherwise we may see some sideways action and here you can see and after that maybe it will hit this level again which is 0 0.64 currently this uh, uh, downtrend line is very very important which is at 0 0.60 if uh, if algorand close over the candle below this uh, uh, downtrend line uh, which is 0 0.60 dollars level and uh, close with the high volume like this like this like this then this will be the confirmation that we may see this level 0 0.52 or maybe it will go more down and hit 0 0.50 dollar or maybe it will hit 0 0.44 these are three targets uh, for Algorand right now for me. Friends, please uh, show me your support and please, please like my YouTube, uh, like my video and please subscribe my YouTube channel for more informative content and very useful information because I regularly update and I will make a very informative content on daily basis. Uh, for that, uh, I have you must have to support me uh, if you support me then definitely i will give you very information uh, informative and very useful uh, content this is in my last chart which is thrown to the us one hour balance chart and uh, thrown is in this uh, uh, rising broadening wedge and if thrown break this towards downside then our target will be 0 0.028 and if uh, this uh, support zone uh, which is currently at 0 0.0306 support drawn uh, and uh, we see if we see uh, some pullback then definitely it is going high to hit this level 0 0.0345 otherwise if uh, uh, drone break this uh, support zone and break this uh, uh, downtrend line which is at 0 0.03058 then definitely it is going to hit 0 0.02845 this is my uh, this these are my targets first uh, target bearish target is 0 0.02845 and upside target is 0 0.03248 but the only condition is the high volume if uh, if uh, tron break this uh, support zone and break this uh, downtrend line with high volume then definitely it is going to hit 0 0.02845 this is the video friend please please show your support please like this video please share this video to all of your friends and please join my telegram channel and uh, and please uh, subscribe my youtube channel links are in this video description and if you are want to open uh, if you want to trade on bybit or in uh, binance exchange the links are in this video description where you can find the link of the binance uh, here just click on this link and create your account and if you want to get $600 bonus absolutely free, then click on this link and click on this link. This is the Bybit exchange link. This will give you uh, these all bonuses absolutely free. Uh, this, this only takes uh, 30 seconds if you want to open new account. Thanks for the watching. Take care, friends.